सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो फ्रॉम एंट्रो बीस्ट सो दिस वीडियो इज गोइंग टू वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग वन बिकॉज इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू ट्राई ऑल द विंडोज सिमुलेटर्स that are released on an android device and we're going to find out which one of the simulator can run gta 4 on a mali and mediatek device uh, without any kind of a graphical or any kind of a lag issue so just stay tuned with this video and without further delay let's begin so the first simulator that is coming in our list is exagear x11 simulator so As you guys know, Exagear is the first ever Windows simulator that released on Android, and it does support Mali GPUs. And let's find out if this simulator can run GTA 4 or, or not. So, uh, to let you know, guys, I am using a MediaTek Dimensity 1200 chipset device, and which has a Mali G77 GPU. So, let's quickly find out if uh, my uh, processor can run GTA 4. So, as you can see, guys. after double clicking on the game the game has started without any sort of issue and it has just loaded all the uh starting uh thing uh, okay so it's working properly now let's see if our game or in game play has an issue or not so as you can see guys our game play has also loaded and it doesn't have any kind of a graphical issues it's working properly but you'll be required uh, to uh, configure your on screen touch control through input bridge application because uh, it doesn't support or exega doesn't support the configuration or control or the inbuilt inbuilt control just like me later so you have to configure your controls through input bridge application so as you can see the game is running um, uh, without uh, there is no not much visible or not much noticeable lag or graphical issues uh, you can enjoy this game if you have at least of uh, helio g99 plus or g95 kind of a chipset minimum and uh, for the setting guys i am not showing the showing the full uh, setting uh, of uh, the simulator that i used to run this game on my mali device if you want to know the full setup and setting of the simulator i will leave the link in the description of my video where you will find out the full setting along with the setup so let's just quickly move to the next simulator so the next simulator that is coming in our list is mobox emulator so you have already heard about this simulator it actually uses your termux um, application to uh, run this uh, emulator so you'll be required termux and termux x11 to use this emulator so i have also made other video where you will find out the full setting and full setup of the simulator you can get the link of the video in the description so let's just uh, quickly test gta4 with the simulator and let's find out if this can run gta4 better than exagear or not so as you can see guys after starting the game game has started successfully without any kind of issue just like exagear and here also you'll be needed input bridge to configure the on screen control setting because this doesn't support any inbuilt controls just like emulator so uh, okay so now we are in game and as you can see guys our games is working properly and it seems like it has a uh, better performance and better uh, better if uh, slightly better fps as compared to uh x care uh, so uh, if you want a little bit more performance and if you have a uh, certainly lower chipset or lower end chipset uh, like helio g85 or plus you can use this simulator and can run gta4 and uh, yes guys if you want to uh, see the uh, longer gameplay and know the full setting and setup the simulator i'll leave the link uh, description of my video where i'll find all the things now let's quickly move to the next emulator our text and the last emulator and we are going to try to run gta4 on winlater in mali and let's find out if uh, winlater can run gta4 on a mali device or not so so here you can see that uh, setting that i am using you can also try this setting okay so here the main setting that play the role is actually you have to change the gpu name to some intel uh, 
brand gpu do not set it to nvidia gpu because the game doesn't work with the nvidia gpu name you have to change it to some intel gpus so after doing all this thing let's just go to that so as you can see guys after double clicking the game the game has started and all the loading screen menus has loaded without any kind of a issue but let's find out in actual gameplay is it working or not So as you can see guys in the actual gameplay game has loaded but the problem is there is a pitch black screen and there is no visible graphics uh, right now so as you can see only the map is visible but there is no environment and character is loaded everything is just pitch black that mean winletter doesn't support gta 4 on a mali device so unfortunately we have to rely on we have to depend on other emulators like exagear or mobox to run gta4 on a mali device